How to get a candle when the world has ended, the power's gone, and you're tired of eating in the dark. The city's burned out years ago. The nights aren't just dark, they listen. Your flashlight died last month, your batteries are museum pieces, and that flicker in the corner might be eyes or just your sanity. You need light, not pretty light, survival light. Start by raiding the woods. Find pine trees, the sticky kind. That ooze on the bark, that's pine sap, nature's flammable glue. Scrape it off with a knife, a rock, or your last remaining sense of purpose. Mix it with moss, dry, dead, brittle. You're basically making a forest candle with the tears of trees. Melt the sap near a fire. Not too close, unless you want your eyebrows to become a sacrifice. Tossing the moss, stir it with something that used to be a spoon, and stuff the mess into a tin can or a skull-shaped souvenir mug. Anything that holds shape and shame. Pine sap is resin, full of turpentine oils that burn hot and long. The moss acts like a wick, pulling up the melted sap for that slow, eerie glow. Light it up. If it flickers, congrats! You've made fire from tree blood and rot. If it smokes too much, congrats again. Now you have a signal or a funeral.